Guys, welcome back to another game console, handheld, whatever you want to call it, review. And this is supposed to be the POW Kitty X70. One thing right off the bat, this thing boasts a 7-inch screen. So I'm hoping it's a nice screen. But I have seen some other reviews out there um, as I'm getting ready to do a review. Sometimes you like to do your homework. Uh, sometimes you don't agree with those uh, statements that are made. And again, that's why I tell people to not only watch me, but watch other people when you're looking to buy something. Because I'm not, I guess, a crazy in-depth, in-depth person. I do the basic functions and what is it like for the regular person that's going out to get it. Now, what's weird about this packaging, there's no POW Kitty marked anywhere. And I know that it's supposed to be one. And even here, it doesn't say it. I think here. So it, it's it's easy to say that this X70 is made by somebody and maybe rebranded numerous ways. And maybe the box reflects that. So if POW Kitty made it, they made it. If they didn't, they didn't. But I bought the POW Kitty X70. So let's open this up. I'm not going to lie. I did open just to take a look at the, the actual size of the unit and everything and I thought that was pretty cool so we're just going to put that off to the side first take a look at what really comes with it which is basically nothing you have a quality control uh, thingy you have your USB-C so that's good USB-C charging cable and your X70 Moving Toilet that paper. aside let's take a look at the handheld so right off the bat, it's a good looking handheld. It reminds me, they even made the grooves here. I always wondered if that was able to come off because it made it look like it could, but it doesn't. And what I got to say is it's very Nintendo Switch like, kind of cleaner, but it is. Um, you, you have your two analogs here. You have your D-pad, your buttons, which are quite, I guess I want to say sharp, sharp edged. And somewhat springy. So I don't know if I like them or dislike them yet. The D-pad feels okay. I'm not going to... And there is no... Maybe this one. But this one doesn't have a click. Or oh, maybe they do. I'm not sure. And if they did, there probably is no reason for it. And I'm going to guess that this here is... It, it looks like a, a recycle logo. So it's probably like a... Uh, refresh or bring you back to home I don't know yet there's start select and on the top here we're greeted with the SD card slot which there's an SD card in there with their preload you have your power button volume mini HDMI and headphone jack for those people traveling or whatever you don't want other people you know listening or pissing them off you have a left and right bumper which kind of they feel good. No no issue there. They feel good. Again, until I turn it on and play with it, I don't know what the responsiveness is like. And on the back, of course, it does tell you everything that I just said here in little logos. And it's the Model X70. I don't see POW Kitty on here anywhere either. We'll have to see if it is on boot up. So on the bottom here, we have your USB-C power. And these are actually two joystick ports. So you can add joysticks if you want and maybe 3d print a kickstand or something and uh and have it up while you're playing with friends or family um and then there's the reset an in a hidden in here reset button looks like a speaker here and a speaker here i will check with my ear and see if they're actually two speakers or one and if i had to make a guess i'm going to say there's a speaker here but not here and the only reason why I say that is, in the venting here for the speaker, I see uh, something here, and I don't really see anything here. So I'm not 100%, but most of these uh, overseas units are kind of like that. So right off the bat here, I'm going to peel off the ever so wonderful screen protector. Oh yeah. 
going to turn on now. So, wow, that's actually a pretty crystal clean screen going on there. Um, you On the angle that I'm looking at it, it does seem a little faded. But seeing it on the video over to the side here with my 32-inch screen, it's uh, looking good. So let's find out if it really is. Um, it said welcome. I don't know if it's still booting up or is it saying welcome to your charging. I have no idea. Doesn't do anything soon. I will hit the power button again. Let's hit the power button again. Oh, so because it's charging. Oh, now it's loading. Maybe it's got enough now to start it up. So it looks like when you're turning it on and you're greeted with Chinese or, or whatever it is, um, and you need to change that. So I don't know what I did to get back. Uh, Oh my god. All that, and there it is. Ah, language is the top one, guys. So if you're looking at this and you're having trouble, language is the A right here. Switch it to English. That was ridiculous. I wish they had something to tell you a little better. So now we have list, type, history, favorite, SEA, whatever that's supposed to be, and file. So we're going to go back to uh, game list. So what I want to do now is I want to test something. Uh, well, actually, let's see. I'm curious right off the hop. PlayStation. And again, Everything is not English. So the system's now in English, but nothing's English. I'm just going to pick a game because I have no idea what I'm picking. And I know that most of the games, and don't get me wrong, you can change the games that are on here and make it all English. That is up to you. Sony Computer Entertainment presents... Stereo speakers. You have speakers on both sides. Wow, it's got some volume. Let's turn that down. All right, and that did do what I... Okay, so here we hit this button, and now we can return to game, restart. Uh, we can save game, load game, settings, and exit. And here we're going to exit because I don't have a clue what that is, and I'd rather play something and see something that I know what I'm playing. Oh. The sound is actually pretty good. Let's see. Oh, sweet looking. I gotta say, this is smooth. Oops, I died, did it? Okay. Now we have it up on the uh, screen, so <laughs> you guys can see everything proper. And you can see that I'm moving it around. We So this is literally the menu. If you go to list, then it's just going to nice, no file. That's beautiful. That might be because it was something I'm supposed to create. I don't know. But anyway, here's the type. Here's my history of what I played in a wonderful language that I can't speak. Uh, favorites, I didn't do any yet. I don't, oh, search. SEA is search, that makes sense. And then file, it's saying there's no disk. 
Well, that's interesting. Let's find out if that's true. So let's go to type. Let's go. Hmm. Let's go. Well, let's go here again, just to take a look at everything recorded. Pro no file. Interesting. Okay. We're back. So it was just some sort of weird um, thing that happened. I don't know. Go to type. Now we can go back in. Okay. Let's. I'd love to know. Yeah, again, a lot of Street Fighter. So that's not my kind of game. But I mean, you know what? To some, this is an awesome thing. But I mean, there's only so many. Street Jam, cool. There's only so many friggin' Street Fighters you want on here. Again, like I said, you can make and put your own games on a card and be done with it. So don't worry about that. And I think this system here it can actually be modded with a different OS or uh, a cleaner OS. So that, those are up to you. I'm just giving you the review of what I think of it out of the box. And this is what I think I was playing. So let's take a look. Cannot remember. It was, uh... So far, I'm, I'm liking the output to the computer with no issues. Like that is... Oh, coin. So coin is actually select, just to give you an idea. All right. Now, I don't think we're recording sound on this anymore. I am pretty certain of it. Let me just double check, but I don't think so because I'm not hearing anything out of the unit. And I don't think I have the unit to set to record it. And that's for reasons that... You know, it's sometimes really hard to to be a YouTuber and have all this stuff put out. And, oops, so I guess I learned a lesson on what that was. <laughs> Crush you all. <laughs> Whoa. Well, oh, see that coming. I love the explosion effect. I mean, that's more realistic than the game is. It's pretty cool. Woo. I want some power-ups. Yeah. Yeah. I'm not God. Boom. Yeah. Here, like I said, you got restart if you just want to restart the game. Return to the game from where you are. You have your save game, load process, settings for the game. And if you go into settings, I think that's, yeah, keyboard mapping, sound output, which, oops. If I went here, what would it say? On, so all right. Um, so you're mapping, if you wanna change your uh, button layout, and of course you know that everything is technically a keyboard when it comes to a gamepad. Most people don't know that, but it's actually true. Screen size, so of course you can go full screen or you can scale. I'm just gonna stay at full screen because, well, so far it hasn't made anything look weird. Joystick mode, digital or analog. That's kind of cool. And reset settings. Okay. No, <laughs> if you look at the picture, it looks like I have to press it. I have to. I have to press it. It <laughs> looked like a terrible, an adult game almost. Haunted Castle. Completely different from what that picture showed. So it looks like a knockoff of, uh, uh, I can't remember the game. Castlevania or something. Let's just see here. Ready. And that's pretty much what it is. Game over. Well, I don't want it to be game over. Okay, so you still had to put a coin in for that. So I'm guessing these, I'm going to guess it's all Capcom. And the Capcom stuff is, uh-oh. Oh, there we go. I don't know how this is supposed to run. But so far, it's, uh, I don't know. I find it kind of, maybe I gotta use the D-pad. Yeah, I find this a little clumsy. I don't know if this is the way it's supposed to be. And I can't very well say that because, well, I've never played this before. Let's go to, uh, I guess this would be, no, Famicom's right here. So what is this? 
FBA. Ah, let's try some Metal Slug. Metal Slug. And it's funny because this is Capcom too. But it's Neo Geo apparently. So it's a Neo Geo game in this mix. Now I think there is a Neo Geo section too. So coin is uh, uh, select and now we're going to hit start. Yes, I don't really care. I just want to see what the game is going to play like. Dun, 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 Roar! Die, die, you die people. <laughs> you all die. Oh, I'm supposed to save that guy. Screw you. I don't know if I really want to save people. What's a waste of time? Oh, fire, fire. Fight fire with fire. <laughs> oh, look at them burn. It's been a while since I played these uh, classics, to be honest, so it's kind of cool. Oh, we don't want that coming around. <laughs> Bombs. <laughs> I die. Looks like it might be a top down. Let's try that out. Dun, dun, dun. Trying to give my own sound effects. Do, 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 do. Dun, dun, dun. Maybe I gotta hit credits. Oh, I think I know this game. Yeah. Okay, you can take off a little faster than that. Please. See, all you have to do is say please. Okay, now I'm using the analog stick and I'm gonna switch to the uh, that's weird how this thing shoots. Woohoo! How come there's no power ups? Oh, that's a power up. And then <laughs> I die getting the power up. I'm like, there's a power up. And then it kills me. It's like. When I'm driving, or when I'm flying this plane, so it shoots straight. It almost like it doesn't shoot straight. It's weird. Ah. <laughs> ah. Okay, but I mean, it works well. And this is the analog stick, so let me try the D-pad. Okay, the D-pad needs to, in my opinion, some getting used to. I definitely have a lot more control on the analog pad, but it does work. I just find it touchy, and which is, please don't tell me to have a Nintendo button somewhere else. <laughs> Super, yeah, okay. <laughs> It'd be stupid to have Famicom, and then they had, uh, you know, Super Nintendo or Nintendo or something like that. It should be all under this. Life Force. Okay. I don't remember what it is. I think I do. Start. Oh, okay. Let's try. Boo, 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 boo. Pew, 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 pew. I just killed myself. Pew, 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 and I just killed myself. I just wanted this stupid thing, so I'm using a D-pad right now just to. Yeah, the D-pad is uh, quite. No, I don't like the D-pad. I'm going to be flat out honest. So let's just try the same game with the analog stick. Why isn't it continuing? Maybe I have to hit start. Yep. Okay. Same game. Now with the analog stick. Oops. My bad. I got no other weapons by the look of it. <laughs> that doesn't seem like a very good upgrade. Oops. Nothing else happens, just the shoot, and that's it. Okay, the D-pad is definitely uh, shitty in this game for sure. The analog stick is better. My gaming just isn't itself. But 
to each their own. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle. Turtle in a half shell. Turtle power. Come on, everybody remembers this. This is the old Nintendo one. Oops, I don't know if I meant to go down. I guess you got to. Alright, I'm only using analog because I, I'll try the D-pad again. I don't like it. Ow. Turtle's doing a half shell. Turtle power! Yeah, I can't use the D-pad. So let's go back to analog. Why is... Is that a delay? Wow. It might just be me, not 100%. Gonna hit jump right now. Right now. I feel like there's a bit of delay. Now. 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 Well, maybe it's just me. Oops, didn't mean to do that. Okay, let's try another game. Or another console. I mean, the games are running okay. Um, I think there's a little bit of delay there. But, uh, let's... Game Boy Advance. There's one, though, that's not normally easily ran. And look at that. Sonic, right off the hop. Right off the hop. Alright. Yes, English, please. Sega! Sega! Sorry. Had to do it myself. Let's hit start. Come on. Get past all this crap. Dun, 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 I have no idea. It said English. Remember? Whatever. Maybe I, I had to move it down or something. Who knows? Dun, 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 dun. Turtle power. Jumping now. Jumping now. Jumping now. Jumping now. Woohoo! Oopsie Daisy Big mean thingy Majuki Oh that's cool Hey Alright No now I'm getting annoyed Then don't keep doing that right that's a great idea. Oh it's up there again Let's do it right here Oh stupid 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 B all right, this game is actually... Whoops. All right, we're going to have to go back here. And go back here. There we go. It's funny because you look at this and you think the game's going to... Hey, it's going pretty quick now. But you will, you don't think that he's that quick in this type of game. But he is pretty darn quick. It's a really cool game. I haven't played this version, uh, only in testing sometimes, and I have to say, kind of enjoying it. So we know that Sonic is working in a Game Boy Advance, so in order to double check that, pressing now, pressing now, pressing now, it seems like it's getting better. Um, the only way to really test this is to try a different game now in this thing that might be a little, I mean Sonic's fast, right? So I would expect that to give me a harsh run. And there's some more Sonics. Look at this. My favorite console already. And then there's this weird stuff that I have no idea what it is. Castlevania. Fire Emblem. These are things that aren't my games. I mean, Fire Emblem is popular. I get that. But not for me. Why does it feel like I just went through the same thing again? How many fire emblems does it need to be? Final Fantasy, not my game either, but kind of cool. Mega Man Zero. I don't know if I was much of a... I like the original Mega Mans. I don't think I like these Zeros. Shining Soul. I mean, it looks like there's a lot of cool games because I know the games that I don't like that I talk about, the, they're popular, right? So. 
Um, not going to, you know, bash it. People have their tastes. I just don't think it's mine. And, uh, what's that? Cadillacs and dinosaurs, maybe? English? Crash? All right, let's try Crash. That should be a little bit harder to run. Crash Bandicool. Crashy. Are you crashy? Universal Interactive. <laughs> the crappy graphics. Now, this is only probably going to put out, I think it says it puts out 1080, but I'm going to look at the video quality after because I can actually check what it actually did record at. And I'm going to think it's more 480 or uh, 720 based on what the console was. I don't think it's really upscaling because that still looks kind of... Eh. I hate having to go through all this crap. Crash. Let's go, Crash. Let's go. Yeah, don't care. Just go. Just go. All right. Hey. I haven't played this in forever. Oops. Oh, yeah, you can't touch anything in this game. Forgot about that. Yeah. <laughs> so either the delay is, let's see. Yeah. I, uh, I either suck or there's a delay here. Let's see. Ready? Jump. 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 I mean, the game is still running smooth. It must be me. Oh, that's it. There we go. So it was me. I just don't know what I'm doing. I get it. And it's kind of like a, a weird Sonic takeoff because you're actually collecting these apples or whatever it is instead of... Um, can you shoot those? I couldn't remember if you can shoot them. Oops. Yeah. So uh, I'm not sure if there's a delay there or I just really suck. I'm not going to bother with Game Boy because if Game Boy Advance is running, I can't see them screwing that up. Um, let's go Super Nintendo. It's nice to see all those games there. There we go. Super Mario World. Now, keep in mind, I'm still playing on the analog stick. Um, I don't know. It just... Let's see how smooth it is. Do, 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 do. All right. So I am going to use um I forgot that I can pick those up. Wow, that was really sad. I am using the D-pad and I'm starting to think I might be regretting it. I'm going to use the analog this time. Now, what was it that picked... Ah, damn it. Wow. I think there's a delay here. I'll try this one more time and see if I'm right or wrong. Yeah. I can't do a double jump. Um, again, I'll do this one more time, but I feel like, oh, okay, yeah, I can, I guess. thought there was a way to carry that. Yeah, see, I'm not exactly happy with that. I mean, the game's running smooth. I don't know if it's just me, but I think the, uh, I think there's a bit of a delay in the trigger, but I mean, okay, let's go back in. And I'm going to hit jump, 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 jump. There's a delay. I can see it. Comment below if you think you can see it too. Because I hit jump, jump, jump. I mean, it's not terrible, but it's there. And it's enough to get you killed. Uh, certain stuff, yes. I'm scared to play Battletoads on this. DigiCon, let's see how it runs with the actual uh, extra processing power going on. Because these games were a lot harder to run 
than the others. Come on, get past it. Get past it. 1995 Nintendo. Digicon. Diddy. 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 Oh. All right. One to players. And this is where you can plug in your second joystick and have fun. Let's see what I get. All right, that's jump. Roll. So jump, 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 jump. Okay, let's see how that goes. I am a donkey, donkey, donkey con. I know that barrel was probably important. Well, so far. Ah! Moot's there. Hey! You die. <laughs> Wimp. That was my error, but so far it seemed pretty good. Funny how the simpler game seemed delayed to me, and uh, the higher end game did not. So now we're going to go to the Mega Drive. My favorite out of all these systems from this era. Oh, gotta play some hockey. Don't remember what's what. It's this one. Uh, who am I? Am I this guy? Yeah, apparently. Ah! Game makes you look bad. No 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 no. No 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 no. I sing, bro. Whip shot. Ah ah ah. Ura ura Oh. Hey, what the beep? No! Anyway, it's working good. It's just my normal. I can't play hockey very well. But these are my favorites. I love, like, Lemieux hockey and stuff like that. They're my favorites. I don't like this new stuff. This is so much easier, so much better. Dong 99. Does that make any sense to anybody? Donkey Kong 99 under the Mega Drive. Yeah, that seems right. Oh! Is this Sudden Strike or Urban Strike? This is one of my favorite games. I love these, but I love a top down. And this one here takes it a little bit different, but awesome. And I loves it. So much I love this game. Okay. The analog stick is probably not my friend here. Let's try the D-pad. What shoot? There we go. Dun 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 Where the hell did that boat go? Dun 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 Ooh, I think I need to deep. Uh, yeah, the analog stick is actually better for this. No, you die. I'm a jerk. Ah! I'm being shot like really bad. Hey. Okay. Takes a bit of getting used to with the analog stick, but I like it more. Maybe I gotta, ooh. Anyway, I'm not a big uh, fan of the controls. Any game like newer PS, PlayStation, that kind of stuff where you can use the analog pad uh, proper using the sticks, I can see this console being great for that. Um, maybe plug in another controller for the games that I'm not happy with, but at the same time, there's not a lot of controllers that are going to be USB that you're gonna have to convert to the USB micro. Hit Neo Geo. Um, that, now here's the thing, you're gonna be a lot of King of Fighters here. So I'm gonna go to the bottom, drift out. Mm. 
road something road army oh road army road army let's check it out anyway so now we're in neo geo um i don't know uh i'm, I'm kind of on the ledge here with this system um if it's going to play more modern titles like the playstation maybe and i say maybe uh some consoles in that era then like let's say this neo geo for example if i'm happy with the controls then this is the kind of shoot 'em up type things that i like um i'm not playing yet oh credits so credits again every time is select okay and yeah whatever let's game start all right let's see what this is like oh yeah i should be able to look at the screen when i'm doing this now that i think about it i don't know why i was being so upset about that that's the idea it seems to be no delay as far as that goes so all right here we go all right let's see you die you die all right the analog stick is perfect for this so let's see how it holds up poop, 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 poop. oh that was a cool move oh bang bang bam <laughs> i like this game <laughs> can i beat this up nope hey Ooh, what was that? Okay, cool. I got the moves, bro. I got the moves. Oh, I got a weapon by the look of it. Yeah, I got me as a baseball bat made out of steel. Hey, that was a jerk thing to do. I wasn't trying to hurt anybody. Oh. Oh, missed. <laughs> There's no delay. I got to say this game is working as I'm asking it to. So that is a plus. Let's the shoulders do anything. Nope. Just trying to figure out all the buttons here. And I'm trying to figure out if the D pad is smoother. We're going to find out. I just switched to D pad. Let's see how the D pad performs in this game. Damn it. They're dogs. Okay, there's one way to kill him. Ooh, music got the, oops, don't do that. Whoa, that was neat. Some of these moves, I have no idea how it's happening or coming. See, now here's the problem. Why can't I, am I hitting them? Uh-oh, that guy's big. Down doggy, here's a bone, here's a bone. Want a bone? Here, 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 here. I'll give you a bone. <laughs> Come back here. Oh, don't do that. Now, is that ghosting or was that like a, a thing it actually does? Because that was weird. But I have to say, uh, that was with the D-pad. Hey. And now we're back on the analog stick, which I think is the smoothest right now. Okay, guys. What do I think of this thing? Well, as I said, if you're going to use the game for Neo Geo, maybe PlayStation... Then I have to say, uh, so far I like that. Game Boy Advance wasn't too bad. I did see, or I do feel, the D-pad is to me the D-pad's garbage. I don't, I don't like it. But oh, I can't get that now. But it is what it is. I mean, you can't have everything. So, but at the same time, I paid about sixty bucks for a console that plays games like this, but no delay, and it looks awesome. So. I'm pretty happy about that. And the sound quality on this thing has been absolutely pretty darn good. Um, whether it's true to the uh, actual reproduction, that's a great question because I've never played this game before. And I know we can't really hear it because for some weird reason, my HDMI out to my thing is not really recording the audio from the console. At least I don't think it is and pretty sure it isn't i'm pretty sure i at one point said it that way because every time i do a nintendo game for example they take my video and try to make their monetization off somebody else and i think that's just criminal but welcome to nintendo welcome to nintendo anyway 
So anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed this. I hope this helped out if you're looking for a system that you want to have some fun with. This one definitely uh, does work well. The screen is beautiful. And when I was talking about the uh, IPS part of the screen, I keep forgetting that IPS is really side to side. And if you go side to side, it's actually really good. It's only when you uh, tilt it that you see fade. So that's just something I wanted to mention. So someone sitting there watching you play can see that no problem and, and so on. But I guess at the same time, why do we really care if the IPS, as long as you're looking at it and it's working well, then that's all you really need. So pretty cool. I'm kind of happy and I, I think I'm just going to keep playing this for a while because I spent a long time. I got it for myself for Christmas. Yep, I said that for myself for Christmas. And uh, so far, um, I'm, I'm happy. I don't open things till I actually go to review it. So sometimes that sucks. Boom! But overall, with games like this, it makes it worthwhile, I have to say. Until they do that. You're making me mad. You're making me mad. What? You were walking around with no body. Bam! Bam! Uh huh. Anyway, guys, till next time. Thank you. And uh, want to lay a beating down on some more of these guys. And until next time, game over. Damn you! You wrecked my barrel. I keep dying.